skeptical on any kind of leaks that we saw on the internet from thenceforth. And it's understandable because um, if you don't remember the whole fiasco, which is the reason behind my desk mark, I mean my um, my desktop right now, Artsy Omni created an amazing leak which pretty much went as deep as any fake leak could go rather than showing off actual gameplay footage. However, yesterday there appeared to be some kind of surfacing of a apparent leak of Mewtwo online and this one was a bit interesting because even though I don't know if they were like one big leak or two big leaks, there either were two really big leaks of Mewtwo that happened yesterday at different times or there was one that was the exact same leak along around the board. So I mean, you guys probably will know what I'm talking about here, but let's look at the images. So first off, I want to thank this guy who sent me these first, Ruben Giligo. Giglio. Yeah, and this will be linked in the um, comments, of course. I mean, excuse me, in the description. However, he sent me images which apparently show Mewtwo. However, these are very skeptical. You know, RC Omni, like this guy basically just pioneered the whole freaking leaked fake leak thing. This doesn't look real at all. And that Mewtwo image looks like one that's definitely been seen somewhere else before. It's definitely not a correct image. And then there's these posted as well too, which apparently show Mewtwo in um, Mega Form Y. And it, it doesn't really look too legit though. I mean, it looks interesting, but these images, I think I've also seen this one before too. Now, if you're wondering why I'm even showing these, I had actually not really looked at these in detail, but now that I'm looking at them, I think I've seen this one before, so yeah, it doesn't look too legit. And then this one, of course, I don't know. I mean, they seem like they're unique images. I don't think I've ever seen that of YouTube before, especially in his Y form. So it does raise some questions as to, you know, where the hell is this from exactly? But my knowledge on the subject isn't exactly extensive. Some of you guys in the comments may be able to know, or who are watching right now, may be able to know better as to where the origin of this image is. But I highly doubt it's in Super Smash Brothers until there's some apparent game footage that came out as well too. So let's go to to this other tweet. This one is also from Bolo Rogue. Wait, no, no, I'm sorry. Well, uh, they have two totally different people. But anyways, um, this one was uh, a result of a conversation that I was having with somebody about Relax Relax. That's my dude right there. We gotta do a video together. But um, this dude, Bolo Rogue, he says, Alex, um, Etika, and this other guy, I don't know if this is fake or not, but it does look pretty solid. And when you say pretty solid in regards to something that's being you know, speculated, it's usually a bit questionable, it's a bit iffy. So what we're going to do right now is prepare our anuses and watch this um, YouTube video featuring this leak or whatever it is. So um, I'm gonna put my headphones in. And I knew that I had to wait until I showed this on camera before I watched it because I want you guys and I to kind of go through this whole thing together. So let's see exactly what the hell's going on here and what we are watching. Okay, whoa, 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 Okay. It looks like Mewtwo. Okay. But why is the recording style so strange? And why isn't it showing us the character he's fighting? I, don't, I doubt the authenticity of it because every single character that has a multi-hit move in Smash Brothers now has a final hit move that knocks you away, so I don't know if this is legit. It's like, it looks like it's a brawl, to be honest with you. Um, brawl with freaking um, mods added in, probably on um, Project M, something like that. I hope Nintendo doesn't sue me for leaking this information. Why would they sue you for leaking Project M? In fact, I mean, well, then again, nowadays, Project M seems like it has a whole lot of legal issues going on with it. But, um, top comment, yeah, it's Brawl, Sanic Hellhog. <laughs> but yeah, it's definitely Brawl. And then, um, some other comments, Mewtwo is not in Brawl. There was also a picture of Mewtwo being in the stage with some glow around him, but I forgot where I saw the picture. That's a old picture. I know the exact picture that he's talking about, too. Damn, man. Nah, nah, nah. Mm -mm, nah. Um, man, everyone can make an image or a fucking video. Bro, I ran my league. It doesn't seem like it's a good spoiler. Wait, wait. Project M? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You hear it from Shrek himself. This is definitely Project M. So if you've seen, a lot of people were linking me this actually. And I wanted to nip this in the bud right now to ensure you all that this is a fake video. It's uh, fake images and all that. Fake, 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 blah, blah, blah. There's not even that much um, review on the video simply because most people can realize just with looking at it at face value, that is definitely not uh, Smash 4. That is definitely Project M. 
And the main reason is because, you know, it just seems way too weird. So um, we're gonna close this out now. Um, so, so far, most of these seem like they're fake. I can understand why some of these will pop up though, considering the Sakurai hype that happened yesterday. There was some interesting stuff about yesterday though, because a lot of people spe um, thought that the video where he was talking about Mewtwo and his speculated release date were fake because they thought that he put his own translations in there, but so far it doesn't seem like there's been really a solid source that's confirmed the authenticity of that Sakurai um, interview. And for most of us, we, we kind of assume it's real for now. I mean, we have to wait until more information comes in, but where's the full interview, you know what I'm saying? So I mean, it. But, um, and also a lot of people did have trouble translating what he was saying exactly, because it's one thing to put up your own English translations, but it's another thing when you actually have somebody who fully understands and is fluent with Japanese. But so far, there hasn't been anything sent to me that seems like it's a red flag for that. So I'm gonna presume it's still real for now. And finally, this last thing, this is a Facebook page which seems to have shown some leaked images of Mewtwo. Now, this Facebook page, I got linked this by somebody and I don't remember exactly who it was, but this person is posting some really strange images. However, thanks to my nigga Artsy Omni, he ensured that nobody would be duped that easy when it comes to fake leaks again. So um, as we can see right here in the comments, here's a request, maybe better quality or a video if that is even possible. And then he says, pick up one of his new taunts. It can't resemble the melee one. And it says, did you get the download code? And I want to see what the bottom screen says that show the percent, but with Mewtwo's percent. So whoever this is, if they are trying to fake images, they're working really hard at it. They have one with Mewtwo and Greninja apparently. But like I said, oh my God, the fucking, like if you, the logic that these fake leakers have, like if you are going to make a fake leak at this point, Artsy Omni showed us, you gotta go hard or go home. You might as well make a fucking video with a model movie because that's the only thing that's gonna convince us now at this point. <sighs> Damn. And then um, here's some more images. To so those of you that requested the Lucario, and, oh my god, no, 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 no. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're going to save these images. We're gonna download this, and then we're going to download this one. Yeah, we're gonna download both of those and any other one that we see. Okay, so here we go. Um, this is another image. Okay, so I'm guessing those images must have come from here. This is apparently YouTube Kirby but on Final Destination stage, taunting and losing Kirby ability. Yeah, pretty project down for me. Also, the 3DS looks like it's moving, but the image looks normal. Yeah, it doesn't really seem correct to me. Um, it looks like they're wave dashing. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot that's wrong with the image. There's so much that's wrong with it. Yeah, I wouldn't believe this is if I were you guys. I mean, if this is legit, but you know, it's kind of funny. What if this is legit? However, because of Omni, we just all have too much doubt. I mean, a part of me wants to believe, but most of me doesn't. And this just does not seem like it's correct. These are the images. Okay, so every image that we saw before came from this Facebook page. It's a little strange because it means that this guy spent a whole lot of time doctoring these images up, but I just can't believe it. I really cannot believe this right now. It's impossible. There's no way. I mean, I guess it's up to you guys, but RT Omni, man, he taught us some lessons, man. He taught us some damn lessons. This guy seems like he's posting a lot of, um, Super Mario stuff, a lot of Nintendo stuff in general. So you know what? Hey, more power to him. But at this point now, I feel like this is definitely fake. But hey, all this stuff will be in the description for you guys to check out for yourselves. So you can make your own conclusions about it. But right now, I'm definitely going 90, 90% fake, 10% real. No, no, my 95% fake, 5% real. It's just, it's just not, no, no. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.